Hi and welcome students. In this Computer Fundamentals tutorial, I'm going to show you how to uninstall programs from your Windows 10 PC. Let's get started. So the first question you might have is, why would you want to uninstall a program from Windows 10? Well, in the case of the program on the right side here, that's Adobe Flash, it was supported by internet browsers from 1996 until 2020. But in 2020, it was no longer supported. So when software becomes obsolete and is no longer used, you're going to want to remove that software. But why? Well, simply because it's not useful anymore. Another reason you might want to in uninstall software is because it takes up lots of space on your computer. Some programs can take up tons of space, and if you're not using it, you should get rid of it. Same with clearing clutter from your computer. You may have installed a program several years ago that you no longer use and it's just taking up space and it's adding to different um, files and folders and it's just cluttering up your computer so you'll want to remove it. Now I'm going to show you how to remove programs on Windows 10. So step one is right here and the first step is to open up the control panel. So I'm going to start this by pressing the Windows key on your computer. So press the Windows key on your computer. It's usually right next to Control on your keyboard in the bottom left. You'll see a little Windows icon. It has four squares in it. From there, you're going to immediately start to type Control Panel. Okay, you don't need to do anything else. You just need to hit the Windows key and immediately type Control Panel. After you type in Control Panel, you're going to click on the icon for Control Panel. And once you do that, it'll open up something that looks like this, which is your control panel. From there, you can move on to step two. Step two is actually uninstalling the program. And to uninstall the program, you need to go into the uninstall menu. To get there, you look under the programs category, which is in the bottom left usually. Now, if your window is reduced or not maximized, you might find it in a different spot, but typically it's in the bottom left where I circled right here. Then click uninstall a program. From there we can move on to step three. Step three is actually finding the desired application that you want to uninstall. Now make sure that at this point you're not uninstalling any uh, important files or programs that Windows 10 runs even in the background of your computer. You're going to want to make sure that you're only uninstalling a program that you're well aware of what it is, what it does, and you're sure that you can uninstall the program. In this example here I chose Google Chrome. The reason I chose Chrome for this example is because Chrome is something that you typically will download after you uh, create your Windows 10 profile and you log into your computer. It's something that is not natively installed on your computer. Why? It's a Google, a Google product and Microsoft is always going to install their own browser by default. So maybe you decide you want to switch to Mozilla Firefox or something like that and you no longer use Chrome anymore. So what you could do is you would then find Google Chrome on the list and then you would click on Google Chrome and you'll see that it's highlighted in blue here. That lets you know that it's selected. From there, you'll click uninstall, which is where this giant red arrow is pointing at. Uninstall. Okay. And you'll see that at the top of your application list. Finally, you move on to step four, which is confirming the ins ins uninstallation. It'll say, are you sure you want to uninstall this product? And then if you confirm by clicking yes, it'll begin the uninstallation process. Now remember, in uninstalling a program from Windows 10 can be very detrimental to your computer if you uninstall something that you're not aware of what it does. So once again, please make sure you only uninstall programs that you're aware of what they do and you're sure that you're not going to, uh, you know, really mess up anything <laughs> bad on your computer by uninstalling it. So you usually by making sure that you um, are well aware of what the program is and what it does through a Google search or something like that is a good place to start. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have more questions about Windows 10 or computer fundamentals, I have playlists available for you um, on my channel page. Also, if you want to learn Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook, or Publisher, I have playlists on those as well. So if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you for taking the time to watch this and have a great rest of your day.